House Deputy Speaker for the Visayas, Pablo John Garcia, has called on the public to actively support the bill he filed before Congress to abolish the travel tax. Here's Wendelin Sabalo for the details. After introducing a bill that seeks to abolish travel tax imposed to passengers traveling abroad, Cebu Representative Pablo John Garcia has called for public's participation and support. The Deputy Speaker for the Visayas said it will make their work easier if there is a pressure from the public for the passage of House Bill 3874 that he authored. Garcia filed a resolution last August 13, adding that the travel tax under Republic Act 1478, which was enacted in 1956, was an obsolete idea. He also said taxing foreign nationals is unreasonable as their income used to buy tickets and even the airline sale transaction are already taxed and is being passed to passengers. Travel tax costs 1,620 pesos for economy class passengers, while first class passengers have to pay 2,700 pesos. This is excluded from the terminal fee. Based on the 2017 records, around 3.7 million passengers will benefit if the bill passes into a law. The travel tax collected in 2017 amounted to 5.63 billion pesos. 50% of it went to Tourism Infrastructure and Enterprise Zone Authority, while 40% went to the Commission on Higher Education and 10% went to the National Commission for Culture and Arts. Garcia said that with the support of the public, he remains positive despite the potential loss of revenue. Wenelin Sabalo, News Pits Tonight.